Hey guys, it's Christina here. So in today's... Mm, I know. Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys my skincare routine. So I actually have gotten a few requests on this video, and even though my skin's not perfect, I decided I'd share with you guys and what I do and what's helpful for me, and yeah. And also in case you're wondering, this necklace is from Dress Up. This shirt is from Urban Outfitters from the men's clearance section. Before we get into the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, even though I haven't seen it yet, because why not? Please click the subscribe button. We're almost at a thousand subscribers. Every YouTuber says first 1,000 is the hardest to get, and then after that, it's like snowballing. So click the little bell so you can get notifications when I upload. And also, my Instagram and Snapchat are linked down below. So you can go add me and follow me on there. Let's get into the. Oh, God, that was really not looking good. Let's get into the video now. Mmm. All righty, so I got like a little paper here with my stuff. So if I look over here, ignore that. So step number one I do is I have the Clinique three step acne solutions. I am a Clinique freak, obsessed with Clinique. Clinique is my go to everything. I love Clinique. So I have acne, I'm a teenager, the usual. Step one, you washing your face. You wet your face, put some in your hand, put it on your face, scrub it in kind of, and then wash it off. Step number two of the three step, it's a clarifying lotion. I'm actually out of this, and I'm, but basically this is like the, what really dries and really cleans out your skin. So you get a cotton ball, put it on top, shake it a little bit, rub it all over your face, and then like if you look at the cotton ball, it's disgustingly dirty. Like there's so much gunk, so much stuff on your face, and I rub it all over my face and my neck and the back of my neck. And step number three, all over clearing treatment step three is basically this prevents your skin from drying out too much anyway so this three-step routine like I do this once in the morning once at night time sometimes I forget you know a teenager got the schoolwork got the stress so I sometimes forget to do it but ideally I do that once in the morning once in the afternoon and this really helps and sometimes my skin does peel because it is quite drying it has a lot of salic acid in it which is what dries out acne if my skin does get too dry I'll either take a break on it and I'll stop washing my face with that one and I'll use the regular Clinique three-step or I'll also in addition to using that I'll put on the Clinique dramatically different moisturizer which you have seen every YouTube talk about ever I've been using this since like middle school sixth grade so I've been using it since like before all those youtubers just saying then after that then I get the Clinique all about eyes which I've talked about before which is so amazing and I put it on under my eyes like where my dark circles will be and I put it on my eyelids as well so this basically helps me with puffiness and dark eyes and just all that so again put this on at nighttime and in the morning because it's just like good after I do that I need to put on you know some sunblock and some moisturizer as well so I like to put on moisturizer which also helps prevent my skin from creating oils because by adding oils already prevents my skin from making the oils so it's better for your acne I use either the Garnier clearly brighter broad spectrum SPF which is just brightening smoothing daily moisturizer so if perhaps I feel like my skin is really dull one morning or something like that this helps brighten it up a little bit it, or if I feel like my skin it's like good but it's like kind of uneven in skin tone I use a Clinique even better skin tone correcting moisturizer so it just kind of evens out my skin tone and then again if uh, my skin is too dry and I need some sort of other lotion I'll go for this one then something I've actually been using so much lately even though to school I don't actually wear too too much makeup I've actually been using this so much and it's the Clinique acne solutions BB cream it's a BB cream which I like because it's not like foundation it's, this is like more natural I just put it all over my face and I'm actually wearing it now which actually helps cover up a lot of acne it is also acne solution so meanwhile it's makeup it's also fighting acne but this it basically it's like a barrier so you put this on first and then you put on any other makeup on top and this kind of protects the other makeup from like ruining your skin and this fights acne and it has SPF 40 so it's like a bonus like it's also sunblock so I don't have to use other sunblock if I don't want to oh, it's so easy to put on it's nice and liquidy too like you have to shake it but like it's easy to apply and it's really light and thin and natural and later once I start taking off my makeup I have two options I like to use I like to use the Garnier skin active micellar water cleansing water which I'm sure you've seen everywhere this has like it's like been all over YouTube all over Instagram and it still is it this it just it's just good it cleans your acne clears out your acne it clears out your makeup easy peasy get a cotton 
swab or something like that put it all over your face it clears it out but sometimes like cotton balls i feel like they don't they're not big enough for me and i just feel like it's not getting everything off my face so if i really want everything off my face then i'll use this ultra light cleansing oil by neutrogena and this literally it's so in weird like it's incredible like i don't understand so it's a cleansing oil but it doesn't leave your face oily because what you do is like you put it in your hands and it's like oily all that put it all over your face and like you just put it like everywhere like on your eyelashes and what i like is that you use your fingers so you can like clean out your eyelashes without having to go like that and then get raccoon eyes you get water and you rinse it off with water and it turns into this like weird white liquid and it just all comes off and there's no oily residue that's like kind of it for like my like everyday routine ish for skincare but then sometimes if i feel like my skin's like really dirty or i just I, I really feel like exfoliating it i will use my clarisonic mia 2 and so it's just like one of those exfoliating brushes and i will use this in the shower because it's just easier to do it there it doesn't like get everything messy or whatever it doesn't drip all over you so i will either use this to like just exfoliate my face and clean it if i just really want to get a deep clean or if my skin does start flaking then i'll just get this wet get my skin wet a little bit and then i'll again exfoliate to get rid of all the dead skin so that people can't see it and although it is more dry if it's like it's like a temporary fix to the dry skin do that and then bam next into some face masks I really like this Freeman avocado oatmeal clay mask I really like it deep cleans purifies your pores pretty color it's like a really light blue then I also like using the Clinique acne solutions oil cleansing mask so if perhaps I've skipped a few Clinique the three-step acne solutions and my skin's a little oily then I'll just put on this face mask which is just it's just white and then I just put it all over my face and if I really just want to like really exfol like really intensely exfoliate my face or I'm like getting ready for a fancy event where I want to look really good in. I'll use the Kate Somerville Exfolicate. I have the miniature version, it's like a trial size. And this is literally only two minutes. It's called a two minute Hollywood facial, but it's like spicy on your face. You feel the spicy. So it's like, you just put it all over your face, leave it on for like two minutes and like it starts stinking and burning. And then you like rub it off and it like really like it's intense. My last two things. Well, this one is just the Bior Charcoal Pore Strip. I've talked about it before my favorites video so good helps clear out all the blackheads on my nose amazing And it's kind of painful, but it's satisfying at the same time. I like it and Then the last thing is because even though skincare people only think skincare of the face like no Like the rest of your body has skin by the way in case you didn't know So I sometimes get acne on my body not on my face So I'll get it like around my chest I'll get it on my back and I'll get it like at the back of my thighs So I use this Clinique. I forgot the exact name but like I just use this Clinique acne bar. So I've got this like scrub brush here I get the bar and I get it wet put it on here till it gets all foamy and then I use this on my back You know, it's not a miracle worker like my acne doesn't completely disappear, but it helps Clinique acne solutions bar So yeah, uh -uh. we made it. That is the end of my skincare routine you guys. I really hope you enjoyed it Sorry if like the setup is kind of weird and the lighting is weird. The sun was supposed to set like at 7.30 and it's currently like 7, but for some reason it's setting early. I've got a little hate up because I'm a little angel. Now that we're finally at the end of the video, you can finally give it a big thumbs up. And again, subscribe down below. We're so close to a thousand subscribers. And yeah, subscribe, click the bell if you're subscribed. My Instagram and Snapchat are linked down below. And also be sure to comment anything you want because I always love reading your comments. And if you're still watching until here, I want you to comment Halo, whatever else you want. And I will know you watched until here and I will try to heart it and comment back. So that's the end of my video. I really hope you guys enjoyed and uh, bye-bye. Let him, let him, let